bottle is extra bit of threat on Devotic for this game one. And I would like to see some more protective uh, support that we can. But no, it's going to be the Nautilus lock in. So fighting fire with fire. But I honestly would much rather be the Blitzcrank in this 2v2 matchup. But talking about the overall game plan of Weibo Gaming, like he said. Flash himself. This is first blood. Uh, Shadow. Well. Now trying to get his way out, but honestly, we know he's dead. I mean, honestly, Shadow, that's a little bit it for first blood over to Xiaohu. What the hell was that? You know what? Deny a lot of mid-jungle synergy coming out of the side of this roster, but so far, so good. I mean, Xiaohu Peking does have really good guns, though. The red and white, no flash available, though, so he has to be very careful. Ulti's early. Onto Shadow, just trying. There's Herald, Flash, Shadow gets How does he it. get out? That's Angel now, Flash, Rocket, Grab, and Shadow's back in, but it might be to his detriment. He's already burnt his Flash. I mean, Shadow, in a crazy place this game. How does the Shadow keep living? Oh, I don't know, but he's going to die. Invincible's going to die for this, isn't he? He leaps, strikes away, but Rocket jump over. There it is, Flash match. Rocket, Grab, connects. But Chris almost dies for it. Ulti burnt by Xiaohu, and he got two kills in that trade. Trying to secure it is the... Way to go, as we have to shine a very sticky situation. Yeah, the whole team's here. He's trying to get the Fury. Ulti's up. Photic cleanses, but nothing you can do. There's enough damage and enough CC for Photic to get his first kill. I've, I do, I've been bagging sand for years. I'm still in gold. <laughs> Season 3, I start ranked. I, get, I think I was bronze or silver. Season 4, gold. I have been gold for almost 10 years. My career is nothing. It's the Not Shy. Not again, Shy. God, he's playing about as well as... Wait, never mind. What? What? Again? Angel gets over. Holy dooly diddly dudly. Dude, the Shadow's going to get out as well. Wait. It's just all about Xiaohu, isn't it? Remember we talked about, you know, the solo lanes and consistency here. Uh, the Shy, obviously, being caught out a couple of times. The dive there, not Bad. respect. You're going to force okay. the top tier too. It's dead. I mean, Xiaohu will make short work of that. Even does some damage oh, the to the TP way from out Invincible? against War. Is big. He's got Flash and ulti available as well. Xiaohu's walking into a trap. Tries the W, but caught out in the end. His ulti does nothing. Norse's way way is... He even flashes a bit of death charge. Follows him maybe to his death. There's his Angel. He's got Flash. Won't need it. Gets a range. And a kill for NIP. Weibo. Too hypey for the inner turret. And kills they needed. They slowed down the game. Invincible on this Jax now, a bit of a problem for Rebel Gaming to deal with. They need two members to really shut this guy down. He has so much escape yep. as well. He did have to burn the flash though, so that's kind of good because... Ready to erupt as well as I'm waiting for the Shy to come in on a flank as Invincible's there. Out. The top laner is going to battle it out, so it's a 4v4, but make that 3v4. But Xiaohu has evened it up with one fell burst. The range is massive as now they jump on Invincible. Left side of your screen, this Hockey Jax is taking the 1v2. As the Blast Cone's taken as well, the Shy just needs to come in for the stun, finds it, and Dragon is found as well, and Weibo have found... Kraken Slayer, also the Ziggs with that Leandri is burning this down straight away. Shadow does have the Flash, oh, but the... Can he get a steal? There's a pink one on it. He sees oh, it. Oh, dear Lord. Okay, Weiwei's ulti not the best, but still, Barret is just taken under their nose. Crisp is willing to die for the Brotherhood. And with that, uh, the Shy Ooh. also... Wow, Photic out with the Gale Force. I think the Shy, did he get solo killed by Invincible because he is dead again? Yes, I will take that as a yes because there's a Jax in the bottom lane taking that tier 2 as NIP. They the did. ulti is still there. Angel slowed on down. Bouncing bombs not connecting from light, but Xiaohu now over the wall. The ulti He's auto. Dead. What a beautiful buffer. Shadow even hurt a little bit on the way out as he has to flash from way, way. But I feel like that was an overplay from this Azir. And now Tristan Ooh. in hand, Baron buff as well. How do they defend this? Oh, they don't. Tristana and Ziggs, by the way. I just realized that. Infernal soul for Weibo is everything is hooked, doesn't connect. Jungle is out of there. Weibo move away as Invincible jumps in, but doesn't find the targets he was after. They are not the droids you were looking for. As back on in, Weiwei returns and gets the soul. The nuke finds its mark as Crisp does not. The Shy is still holding onto that TP. No one's died yet, but Invincible is about to change that as Dwar dredge lines to save the rest of his team, but I don't even think it will. Shadow is getting shredded like no tomorrow as Angel, his heart was in it. 
but the game was not going to let him struggle any longer. The Absolutely insane team fight coming out of Weibo Gaming, suffocating NIP even in a 4v5 situation and waiting for Weiwei to make his way back into the Dragon Pit and of course sealing the deal by getting that smite onto the final Dragon, securing themselves this Infernal Soul and double inhibitors. Now they're just going to reset and work towards that third one and NIP... Down. And with the pushing power that we have talked about over and over in this game, let's just get ready to see it in action. Oh, was that a mistake? That was a mistake. Yeah, you yeet Xiaohu out, but, well, excuse me, not even Xiaohu, Light. But he's here now for another angle on top of Invincible. He has to get out of there himself. Flash hook and, oh, no. He's dead too. Weibo with I mean... two quick kills and top is now broken. Invincible. And two extremely nice hooks onto both the support and top laner. It's not about the ones you miss, it's about the ones that hit. And by the 20 minute mark, man is making the difference in these team fights. As sure as he's looking for another one, but it misses. Right here for game one, 27 minutes in. And this team has played so well. Xiaohu on this trip starter. Oh my god! Xiaohu almost solo killed under turret. It may as well have been as he picks up a double. I know who my MVP is. From start to finish, this guy's been fed a couple of meals. And Xiaohu on this Tristana needs to be respected in game one. We asked for consistency out of this Weibo Gaming roster and Xiaohu delivering us with this lovely Tristana for game one. And like you said, MVP worthy uh, experience for the audience.